everybody, welcome back. All right, so we're still working on leveling up here because we're talking through it because we're we're nerds. We're goddamn nerds. <laughs> nerds. We're nerds. We're fucking nerds. Okay. Anyway, so, oh wow, my dexterity is low right now. Actually, yep, that's the bad part about a fire mage. That's not bad. I mean, it's kind of shitty to start off with. Let's pop that up and let's pop endurance up right, just a little bit. Because, yeah, I, I'm definitely, with the way I play, I'm definitely going to need more uh, more stamina than what we have right now. Okay, so why don't we explain a little bit about what each one of those does, at least the main stat, as far as endurance and then uh, HP. Oh, here, we can look right through it. Here, uh, 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 explanation. Here we go. So, souls, that's how many gets. souls you get. That's the currency in this game, and it's the stuff you use to level up. Uh, vitality gives you more uh, Health points. hit points. Yeah, uh, attunement. Uh, you need uh, the more attunement you have, uh, the more spells you can equip, and there's like certain um, thresholds. So you have this much attunement, and you can equip this many spells. We don't need to worry too much about that right now. Um, endurance is stamina, equipment load, and resistance to bleeding, uh, which is important because when you start bleeding, you just lose health like crazy. Uh, equipment load is good because you can. Uh, we're eating chips and salsa right now. It's pretty awesome. Um, the more equipment load you have, the heavier what or the heavier uh, stuff you can equip and still be able to roll quickly. So you you want to try to keep at a certain ratio um, of equipment load in terms of what you have and what you can equip in order to stay fast. Or you equip more and you become slower. Right. But the more you level up your endurance, blah 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 blah. Uh, strength uh, strength will stack with powerful weapons like slower, bigger weapons like maces, etc. Um, dexterity is for advanced weapons, stuff like like swords and katanas and some spears and shit like that. Resi All the cool weapons in a game. Resistance is uh, boosts defense and resistance to poison, but honestly, it's kind of considered a useless stat just because you have to put so much into it to build up a resistance. It's right. more, it's smarter to build up the resistance by upgrading certain uh, equipment that you get. Exactly. Uh, so don't waste your points. Intelligence. Um, uh, governs how much damage you can do with sorcery spells, with sorcerer spells, basically. Um, so if, you, if you're using a sorcerer, you want to put a, mu a bunch into intelligence. But since we're using a pyromancer, would we really want to put anything into intelligence? Ah, delicious water. No, that's the interesting thing about pyromancy, is you can purchase the spells, but the only real way to level up the damage of your pyromancy spells is to level up the pyromancy flame that you have equipped. Right. So don't get that confused whenever you get a pyromancer thinking that just because you use magic that intelligence increases the damage because it doesn't. Yep. And faith is for miracles. That's the uh, that's the uh, the cleric stat uh, for using cleric weapons or for using cleric spells. So we don't really need any of that. So we're going to focus this on kind of a... HP, um, endurance, strength, dictator. Maybe a little vitality, but we're going to focus on um, definitely dexterity, endurance, and... Um, We'll throw some attunement in. Yeah. Well, way later once we actually get the uh, the pyromancy trainer. All right, so we just grabbed the majority of the stuff here. Uh, we're starting off here, so let's actually go fuck some shit up. Yeah. We are still recording, right? Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right, so let's go fuck shit up. We probably after the problems we had, we probably should have checked the fucking last footage we had, right? All right, everything was fine. I'm sorry. I'm just fucking. I'm a goddamn idiot. Okay. All right, so here we go. We're gonna go up here towards the undead berg. So kill some shit. This is either gonna go really well or really fucking bad, depending on how garbage I am. All right. Now, can you do a backstab with a mace? Absolutely. It just bam. It's just a different animation, basically. With a sword, you actually fucking stab motherfuckers. Right. But with uh, not a sword, you do other shit. Oh wow. So yeah, I didn't even. Well, I did damage, but uh, I didn't. I blocked it, and it didn't. It didn't uh, uh, stagger him or anything. It's kind of annoying. Uh, let me remember to keep my Estus up here because I hate when I have something else equipped instead of Estus, and then I go to use the Estus and I fuck it up. All right, so he's dead, and now I've got two guys on my ass. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Two at once. I like it. I like it. All right, let's so, heal up. So do we want to pick up the ring or let us... Yeah, go? I'm going to go get the ring just because it's here. Um, there's a ring of Crackrifice here. Boop. Nice. Take some damage there. And this will help. 
This th this ring it, it basically makes it so you don't lose any uh, right. souls or you don't lose humanity, which is kind of important if you're like trying a boss for the first time and you're using humanity. So like if you're trying to co-op a boss, you can equip the ring of sacrifice, and then if you die, you just you don't lose anything basically. Yeah, there we go. Nice big jump and roll. So much tense fucking bullshit. Like even jumps like that, it it sometimes it almost feels just like oh my god, I'm gonna fuck it up. And then everything's gonna go bad, and everybody's gonna be angry at me. Let's see what we got there. Boop. Yeah, let's grab more souls of lost than dead. You don't use those unless you need them at a bonfire. Because if you use them and then you lose the souls, then you know. Uh oh, that was a bit too preemptive. This thing is a fucking werewolf rat. Giant demon rat. Yeah, we'll run into more of those later on. We'll run into some that'll fucking... You, you, you'll, you'll freak out. You, you, you'll be surprised, I'll just put it that way. But it's gonna be fun. Here we are, coming into the undead burg, coming so hard, and we're just like, Hey guys! Hi! Boop! Boop! Alright. Alright, let's see. Can I get him? Yep, yep, we got him with the backstab. Backstab is an automatic if you get behind an enemy and hit him. Um, as long as you are a uh, target. Yes, uh, it does a lot of damage and it's it's really, really good. And it helps with uh, bigger, crazier enemies uh, that you run into later in the game. Uh, fuck your couch. Oh, shit. Yeah, fuck your couch. It helps now, you. you notice... Uh, the shield he's using isn't blocking 100% damage. Yeah, why am I so. even why am I even using that since it's so bad? It's so bad. Um, the shield stats that you get, you can get shield stats, um, or if you look at the shield stats, it'll tell you how much of something it, it blocks. Right. So if you get a shield that blocks 100% of damage, then you know, cool. Like the. Uh, oh, cool. So the, this does one. The heater shield for the warrior class that you automatically get in the game. Blocks 100%. Yeah. As so. long as you have the stamina to take the hit, basically. Right. And that'll actually, that's actually a pretty interesting modifier, because if you, modifier? God, I can't fucking talk today. Because if you, if you don't have enough stamina to take a bigger hit, then you're still going to be damaged. Yeah, I like the one hit we're doing right now. Once we get the longsword, we can, aw. Rubbish! It's so rubbish, you guys. Arr. Okay, cool. Now here you are, and run up the thingy thing, and a ba -der -ba -der. Uh, So we might. Odds are, we're gonna ditch a shield, or we're going to ditch the shield at some point. Just because. Uh, until we get one later. In fact, I'm gonna ditch the fucking thing right now. Uh, change equipment. I just pop it off right there. Because at this point, we don't really have a use for it, especially since it's not blocking all the damage. So we can play much more carefully, and we can play, since we, we have a, a quick... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Since we have a quick... Dick. Quick dick, all right. No, since we have a, a quicker character with a low equipment load, we don't really have to worry about blocking, because we can actually roll a lot better. Illusory wall ahead, I don't... You're a fucking liar. You're trolling me. There's no illusory wall. You're a liar. <laughs> Fuck you. There probably totally is, and I'm just too fucking stupid to realize it, but... Damn. Who cares? Shut up! You're not my dad! Alright, where are we? Okay, we're here. Let's grab this thing. Maybe they were talking about the, the white... Uh, the, uh, the white wall. Yeah, the mist wall or smoke yeah. thing or whatever the fuck it's called. White light. There we go. That's what it's called. Yay, words. Okay. Now, I know you can get over there. Oh, you absolutely... Oh, my God! I, just, I keep uh... forgetting... I keep forgetting that he... Yeah. <laughs> Did you poop a little? I pooped a little. Um, to get over there, we gotta go up and do a thing. But... All right. We'll get to that shortly. Gotcha. We gotta go over there. So, this is the Undead Burg, and a lot of people... This is kind of the tutorial area. Not really... Oh, shit. He jumped, like, a thousand feet. Oh, I'm taking it hard. Heal. As shot I sit in the there. Back. Yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna go up there and we're gonna deal with him there. And we're gonna blah blah blah. But I'm quick enough that I should be able to avoid his shit just by moving, just like that. I'm gonna pop in here and hit him before he gets me, and then 
Final hit there. There's the bonfire. Did he give us anything? Uh, we'll rest at the bonfire in a second here. I want to clear out the area. Unless you die. Yeah. And then we'll have to start all the way back at the other bonfire. That's always a uh, unfortunate possibility here. Hey, buddy. Yeah, you see that shit? Exploit this game. Yeah. Let's see. Can I stagger? Okay, cool. So one hit from that can actually stagger an enemy. As long uh, as a shield an enemy. A hollow shield an enemy. Alright, so let's drop down here. There's a merchant over there, but we don't need to visit him yet. So we're gonna go over here and drag that guy out, and then we're gonna go grab the rest of the items in this area. Okay. Um, stamina conservation when you play as melee is insanely important. Um, if you don't do it properly, uh, you're gonna have a bad time. Because using extra stamina and basically fucking yourself over. Man, I'm going through Estus like crazy. Using extra stamina Maybe we got the miracle. just by button mashing or... No, I'm not worried about miracles at this point. Yeah, Using extra stamina just by button mashing and accidentally doing extra hits or extra rolls, etc., etc. It's right. really bad uh, because then when you need the stamina to actually avoid an attack or block an attack or get in a final hit before somebody kills you, uh, it might not necessarily... There's throwing knives. Uh, that's how you get down there. We'll jump off of here. Uh, it might not necessarily help you in the long run. Um, because if you don't have the stamina, you can't do it. Boo! There we go. We'll grab... I don't remember what's up here. Just some shit. Uh, it's definitely an item. Well, there's there's a, a small crossbow right here. Okay, cool. Uh, which oh, is kind of okay. useless. It's it's good for, for uh, pulling enemies from a, from a distance. Which we won't really be doing well, too much of here. And when you... I'm gonna be buying a short bow here. Exactly. Uh, shortly. Yeah. See, this is why I didn't rest at the thing because now these enemies aren't here, and I don't have to worry about getting ganked on my way back up to the. Uh, the... Makes sense with your confidence of survival. The fuck did I want to call it a fireplace? I want to call it a fireplace. <laughs> That's dumb. I'm dumb. Everybody's dumb. Uh, let's grab the other shit in the area here before we go up and rest, and then when we do go up and rest, then we'll go up and rest. Okay, wooden, wooden shield. shield. Let's take a look at the stats on the wooden shield here. Alright, so it blocks 93% of physical which is, damage. Which is pretty good. Magic. Well, it's it's fine, but very shortly we're going to get a much better shield here. Okay. Now, I'm not sure if you can sell or not sell items. You cannot sell items. So all the extra stuff you're not going to use, you just need to throw it away. Well, you put it in a bottomless box. Now, where is that bottomless box? Uh, you purchase it from the, uh... Yeah, let's get your ass, girl! Ugh! Yeah! Tap that booty! Ah! Uh, yeah! Make you taste that dick! Okay, anyways, you purchase it from the merchant that's uh, down the way over there, but I'm not worried about it right now. Uh, you can carry infinite items. You can carry infinite everything okay. in your inventory. So and it, and it doesn't... Down. Yeah, it doesn't affect the way you play. The only thing that weighs you down is what you equip. So if I were to equip Night Armor right now, uh, since my equipment load is relatively low, it would slow me down and it would make rolling harder and it would give me some, uh, it would make me swing slower and everything. Right, right. But just the fact that I have it in my inventory isn't enough to make it uh, difficult for me. Cool. All right, uh, let's level up here. Let's dump a few more things. Let's dump two into strength right now, just because it'll help out. Also, look at how much it scales with that mace up to 109 there. So it's scaling for three damage per stat point with because the, the mace scales with strength. Yeah, and then when we get something that uh, scales with dexterity, dexterity. that will help uh, to have higher dexterity. So kind of a, a cool rule of thumb is to get everything up to 16 in the beginning and then start stat dumping. Just so you kind of have that, you know, that base built up. Okay, so everything just, is 16. It's just, it's kind of, it's not necessary, it's just kind of a, a, I wouldn't even call it a rule of thumb. I call, how did, uh, he's just fucking around, he's fighting somebody. That is a guy playing somewhere else in the world. So that, but you don't, honestly, ass. you don't want to do every stat up 16, only the ones that are relevant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, endurance, strength, everything like that. Just because it'll give you a decent base for equipping stuff if you do find a godlike thing that you need. I have to block there. If you do find something that's godlike that you, you need to equip for a while just because it's leaps and bounds above, above everything else that you have. Right. 
It helps out to have spent the stats on it, you know, just anyways kind of deal, you know what I mean? Because then if it's like, oh, well, I got this thing and it's leaps about and bounds above what I have, but I need, you know, 18 strength, then you can just go and throw two stat points into it later. There we go. I knew he was coming. I kind of know this area like the back of my hand. It doesn't make me any... Oh, that was bad. That was dumb. Fuck it. Well, normally I take care of them in there, but I'm going to drag them over here. Come here, bro. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here, boy. Come here, boy. Oh, that's a good boy. Let's see if I can get you both at the same time. Nope. Okay, there we go. Sweet. Okay. Those guys are down. We can throw their shit and run the fuck through. We are going to continue on here in the undead bird. It's, it's a great... It's a. I really like the starting idea because it really gives you a... a uh, what's the word I'm looking for? It really gives you the opportunity to get a feel for what you're doing in the game without being too... I guess punishing right in the beginning. Although it is punishing if you're playing like an idiot or you don't know what you're doing. But if my uh, experience is any indication, by this point in the game you're running scared and you're fucking scared of everything and you're like, ah, it's gonna hit me! Oh my god! Ah, 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 right away. And you're super careful at this point and then you kind of get a feel for what you can and can't. Fuck me! You kind of get a feel for what motherfucker, what you can and cannot do. I'm just gonna sit there and keep eating fireballs, huh? No, fuck you. Alright. Um, a lot of people I talk to do not recommend using the, uh, uh, or getting the master key as a gift right away, simply because it allows you to experience the game out of order. Weakness, gorgeous. What the fuck? I guess it does look sick. Look at that. I think we eventually get to go up there, and it's awesome. Anyways, uh,. With the master key, you get access to stuff like this, but it also gives you the ability to uh, play the game out of order, like I just said, um, which a lot of people don't recommend simply because if, if you, you know, end up in the wrong area too early, you're going to get your shit pushed in, such as, like, when you use it and you get to the Valley of Drakes. All right, let's see. Yeah, that's right. So that can stun them, and then we do that. All right, now we're going to go up here and deal with this fuck nut here. Corner. Ba -der -ba -der. As soon as we get a, uh, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, long sword. We're gonna switch over to that and possibly go sword and board. Um, although yeah. I don't know at this point. I well, really, if I really lucky, don't. We'll get the Dark Knight sword, and that'll be fantastic. Uh, you mean the one down here at the bottom of the thing? Yep. Oh look, you're Estusing. How unfortunate for you. I think I'm about to get. Yep. There's my long sword right there. I'm not going to fuck with him right now. I'm not going to. Um, doing this right now is a bad idea because there's a man up there who wants to hurt me. Okay. So let's see. Oop. Sword. Uh, and board. I want to toggle status. Damn it, I'm screwing this up. Okay. I want to look at it here. Okay, 80 plus 12, so I'm 92 right now because it stacks with dexterity and strength. So I actually so get more now, for both. Yeah, now <laughs> does it double if you have... Dexterity and strength increase at the same time. It will, it won't double, but you will get points for each, each point you put each. into each. So that's awesome. I agree. So let's go up here. No, no, he's got a thing, and we gotta get. No, 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 no. Fuck him up. There we go. I should be using him two-handed. I don't know. You think I should do it? Think I should go for the knight? Go get him. The pyromancer. But if you're gonna go for the knight, you're gonna need the shield. Uh, no. I've beaten him without the shield. Oh, well, have fun. The Pyromancer absolutely uh, has the... Oh, that's right. Yeah, you can just... He absolutely call. has the ability to take this guy down, but you have to be fucking careful. Because, like, I am going... I'll get the backstab on him yeah. here as long as I don't fuck it up. Well, and then I'll use the Pyromancy for the rest of it. Yeah. Because this guy, he's a little tough to get behind once he starts attacking you. But once that's... I get once I get the initial attack in here... And yeah, and I'm going to back the fuck off here. And get up here where I have some space to run around him. Now, another tactic, if you're confident in your parrying abilities, is if you're running a sword and shield, you can just parry his attacks. Oh, let's try, let's try this. It. Let's try getting him to come up here and then dropping down on him and stabbing him. By the him. way, the Dark Knight will follow you everywhere. There's no limitation, really, where he will not go to follow you. Where the fuck you, did so. he go? Don't forget about the guys who are still up here with you. Yeah, I'm going to take care of them because the Dark Knight isn't up here yet. 
Didn't you guys know he's Batman? <laughs> Where were the other Dark Souls going? And he's not... He, he totally fucked off. Uh, he's down there. Well, I know he's down there, but like... Did I just, like... Is. Where? There. Oh, he's right there. Oh, do you think I can do it? Probably. Are oh, you gonna try to jump off and stab him in the face? Oh, yeah. No, 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 no! Oh, oh God, no! no! Fucking whore! <laughs> oh, shit! Not getting those souls back. Oh, no, yeah, you are, because it'll... it'll oh, oh right. God, I kicked over my water, but there's nothing in it, so... Damn! Fucking burger burger. <laughs> I should have taken that more at an angle and slower. All right, well, I died, so here it is. Yeah. Over to you, sir. I hope you yeah. remember a little bit of what you're doing here. Uh, so you've got you've got your gestures. Um, y will switch between... What are you doing? Put it in the shield. Oh, uh, just... Okay. I'll make sure to keep a shield around. Uh, hit B. There you go. Noob status. I recommend with these guys, you can uh, do a three-hit combo. Uh, so you get rid of them. Don't jam on it like that, because then you'll do extra, ex extra hits if you're not careful. And at, like, the worst opportune moments. Uh, I would go down there and clear them out just because you don't want the, that guy to come up behind you while you're uh, making coffee. Making coffee. Making coffee. Uh, yeah, yeah, be careful. There you go. Now hit him up. It's nice when the uh, when the the sword actually kind of stuns them like that. There, now you should be good to go on to the next area. Now, if you if you run through here, that guy over on the left is gonna run through immediately. So as yep. soon as you go through the door and see him, just start swinging or do that. Be careful. Hit him up. There you go. You got one of them. Just get the other God. one. Okay. Okay, you're good. You're good. Just heal up. But we're sticking with decks, so uh, that's not going to open yet. You'll get that later. All right, I would recommend running in that building yeah. and killing the guy, and then just for the souls, kill the guy around the corner. Like literally, you just have to run around the corner and slap his ass. Thought he was going to die. You're with kicking that one him. Hit. You're kicking him. Well, once we get once we get our stats up a bit, it'll be much better. All right, so, so far so good. Um, don't forget you have your shit up right now. Get him. Get him. Get him. Don't go out like a punk bitch. He's not dead. Oh, the one came from. Nice. Okay. They're a little close, but that's okay. All right. So once we take him out. Well, Would you try to? Oh, don't use the don't use the heavy attack yet. I um, used to try to use the parry. Oh, uh, I I've never been good at parrying. That's how I beat the Dark Knight last time with the parry. Oh, it's really? Like, yeah, it's, that's how I do. So is that is that like our first big obstacle? Is we're gonna take that motherfucker down? Yes. Kind of deal. He's going down. Okay. He's going down before we do anything. I wish you the best of luck, sir. You're gonna but do. Takes, you're gonna do about 99 damage per hit. Uh, you want to go down there and drag him out first. I have a different tactic. Okay. Good luck, because you're going to drag the guy from the right there. Nope. I'll let him walk away a little bit, and then we'll go down here and deal with the business. Oh, you're actually going straight for him. Yep. Remember, walk slow, and if you have it equipped two-handed, you're going to do uh, more damage on the backstab and on dropping down attacks. Good. So it, it kind of worked that fucking... Uh, what is it? I hope you you remember and have your feel for when to do the backstab. That was not it, sir. Well, you told me to two-hand him. Well, I told you to two-hand him, but I'm saying you weren't close enough to get him with the backstab. Great. Uh, you're gonna die, bro. Oh! Oh my god! Oh! Heal! 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 Oh god! This is not good! Oh, this isn't good! At least grab the item, but we're gonna have to go down here and get souls. Did we grab the souls? No, uh. we didn't. Motherfucker, there were 2,000 souls. Oh, you can't see. Oh. Oh. 
Don't die! Too late. Oh, come on. We just lost 2,000. Burger, 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 burger! We'll get him back. No, we won't because we just lost them. No, I mean, we'll re. re we'll get those, them. but we just lost 2,000. We'll Fuck. make more. Of course we will. Claymore, great sword, attack, regular thrust. See, because once you get, once you get like a, a big two-handed weapon like that or the Zweihander, um, you're able to. Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? You're able to single-hand it, or you can. As long as you have enough strength. There's one down. There's two down. There's three down. I'm gonna pop him just for the funsies of it. Come here. Come. There we go. Build up our, our cache of souls again. Run through here. How about to conserve stamina? Slap this guy in the face. Let him do his shit. Wow, I fucked that one up. There we go. Okay. We did. We are, we're okay. Okay, things are happening. Things are good are things. Alright. Yeah, we oh, get yeah. that backstab and the frame rate drops like a motherfucker. Kill, kill, kill your face. Murder, murder, murder so your you, mama. So you can backstab while you're doing it. Happy love time. You, you can, close. yeah, you just, yeah, you weren't, I you weren't in the optimal range when you tried it. Also, if I remember correctly, when you're in the backstab animation, you are invincible. Well, that or the parry. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. yeah well, the guy was trying to stab me while I parried the Dark Knight. That's I didn't, good to I didn't know. Do any damage? Well, I'm gonna take I'm gonna take out them and do my normal routine before I even try the the knight again. But we gonna get we gonna get his butt. Gonna learn today. I'm coming for that ass, Turkish. Damn, I'm fucking this up terribly. Uh, I'm on here. Um, yeah, yep, 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 I agree. Uh, and we should probably kindle the bonfire the next chance we get. There we go, there's like that guy. I like how you break his defenses. Oh, he's coming. Cool. Yeah, once you, get, once you get a better weapon, you can actually totally fucking uh, just knock through their shield attack, the, the basic guys like that. And if you want... We'll run down here and grab our souls, and then... The souls are on the other side of him. Mm -hmm. That kind of sucks. I agree. But the good news is, we're not going to drop down and die like we did last time. In fact, yep, there are your souls right over there. Alright, so there's that. You can go grab your souls if you want. See if we can't hit him again before he brings up the block. All right, we're doing pretty good. We're doing... Shit! Oh, oh. Get out of there! All right, he's gonna run up again. Get that fire Come on, bro. Ready. Come on. Get him! Oh shit! Run! So take one way. more. Oh, there you go. I'm not worried about it. Yeah, there we go. Now he will never come back again. We got Black Knight shield. Shield works nice. for me. All right, let's take a look. Let's take a look at the stats on the shield here. This actually, oh, better, these are better. actually really good. It blocks. Well, it does 68 damage, but physical 100%. Uh, fire 95%. 95%. This is a fucking good shield. We're gonna, yeah, we're gonna. I'm gonna keep that up. We insufficient need 16 strength. strength. Okay. Well, the good. Uh, that's uh, uh, insufficient to uh, wield it one handed. And get our so. souls. I agree. <laughs> But yes, this is good. We've done we've done a cool guy thing. All right, so that guy's down, and we just use sneaky, nasty, whatever. Did we grab the item off the guy? What yeah, was I, it? Yeah, I grabbed it. It what was a uh, blue, uh, blue ring or something. Blue diamond ring or something. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, let's take a look at this. We've got blue tear stone ring. Yeah, blue defense, defense. while HP is low. Uh, health is low. Okay, is good. it's okay to start off with. You get much better rings later on. Of course. Uh, and see. you can actually put the other ring on just in case we die. We don't lose our souls. Uh, I'm not worried about that right now. I'm gonna worry about that later because we can always go back and get them. Gotcha. Try wing. So this is. Uh, I don't think you can get over there. I think that's just the thing. Um, but uh, normally there's like a troll uh, uh, message there from people who are like, "Well, try jumping," and then you jump and it's like, "Well, there's nothing there. You're fucking stupid, bro." <laughs> You're fucking dumb as shit, dick, bro. 
All right, so down there, and we're not fighting him now, is Havel the Rock, who's like a big... He's actually... Down where? He's actually down all the way down these stairs. Okay. There's there's basically a giant knight who can fucking kick our ass. Um, and he's actually kind of really important to the story. He's not really important to the story, but he, he's kind of a big part of the story. And it's kind of a kind of a sad story he has, um, uh, which is cool. Uh, was there a thing? Was there a thing? Is there a twinkling Titanite guy? No. Okay. Every now and then you'll run into this little like thing, and if you kill him, uh, you get twinkling oh, yeah. Titanite, which is good for that. upgrading later. Um, but Havel the Rock was one of the most trusted knights of Lord Gwent. Oh, there it is. So let's fuck this guy up. Yeah, there you go. twinkling titanite and a titanite chunk, which is great for upgrading later, which scales the uh, the parameter boosting we talked about earlier. Look at him flop down the stairs. Yeah, it's like a slinky or a ball or. Beep 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 beep. I would gladly pay you Tuesday for a hamburger today. I don't know why I immediately went to that guy, but yeah. Okay, so we're not gonna fuck with him uh, with the the. the uh, Taurus demon yet we're gonna go level up here so, so that sounds good. this is our next step then we're gonna run through it then we're gonna grab some shit then we're gonna fuck with him did I kill the guys up there no nope. I did not okay more there's souls yeah there's a few more souls for us there which will go into strength which will help you and help us uh, here uh, then we're gonna be worried about dexterity from that point on yeah, so unfortunately that alerts easy. everybody else Oh, Jesus, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Roll. Okay, there we go. No, I'm not rolling all of that shit. That's a bad, that's a bad call. If you roll there, you're going to have a bad time. There's an area you can jump to over there, but there's... Oh, wait, where is it? There it is. Are you talking about down there? Yeah, but we already got that from earlier, right? No, we did not. We will get down there No, that was the ring. That's where the ring was. Was that? Yeah. Oh, yeah, then we got it. Yep. Oh, look at him fall down. And he disappeared. Video games. Okay, cool. So yeah, so far so good. We we took care of that motherfucker. We fucked him in the ass. All right, let's run back to the firelink shrine here, and level up. Hell yeah. Here we go. We're gonna put in 16 strength, and then we're not we're not gonna touch it for another like 10 years. Sounds painful. Yeah, yeah. All right, now what does the the numbers up here, but next year? Uh, that is the mean? that is um, referred to by the community as soft humanity. Here, if you look here, I have all this humanity here in item form, right? Right. So let's say I pop it, right? Bam, now I have soft humanity up there. As I'm 99.99% .99 certain that will never go away. So even if we die, even if we do whatever, it never goes away because it's just a counter in a meter that we have. Okay, so what does it do? Once you have humanity, you can use it to go human. You, the cat fart? It sounded like the cat farted. Anyways, uh, you can use it to go human. You can use it to kindle bonfires. You can use it to do co-op stuff, etc., etc. So it's actually really important. Um, but when it's up there in that thing, yeah, it's, it's not an item, so it's not something so you're carrying around. So it's just a around. counter, but you don't, it'll never go away. That is correct. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's level up 16. the strength here, and then we have enough to put up dexterity at this point. So let's pop dexterity. Then we're going to pop uh, yeah, all these help. lost undead oh, souls we souls. have, and oh. then that's going to help us out here. So here we are. Now please subscribe to my channel. Here we do full playthroughs of some of our favorite and most hated games. We do cool one-offs like Complete Idiots Play and Spoiler Alert. And every now and then you can catch us on the weekends for some awesome multiplayer games with our best friends the Wonder Pets. I hope you guys like all the new episodes we have coming out every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Uh, please subscribe so that you can check out all the new content as it comes out. And we'll see you next time.